Hey YouTube family, we hope everyone is having a wonderful day. It is two. Oh, go Hello ahead. Hello everyone. Sorry, y'all. I'll get to talking and, and I, I, I don't know when to stop. But anyway, we are um, on our way to M&S. It is 2.40 in the afternoon. And so we've been quite busy. Leon painted, um, planted the sweet potatoes today. And so um, we planted a tub of sweet potatoes and then the other plants that we had left over, which was a long neck squash, I believe. And what was the other thing? Cucumbers. And some cucumbers. We also planted that. So he cut the uh, one of the black tubs in half. He went to Lowe's and picked up some more potting soil, some topsoil, and also went to the feed store and got the animals feed. And then um, I've been doing some organization in the house. So we've decided to go ahead and start on the kitchen pantry remodel. So we're going to the M&S to buy some shelves for that. And we thought we would take y'all along with us because we also have to run by Walmart too to pick up me some soup in a cup. And I wanted to look at the shelves. Hey you guys, we are here. I've brought y'all here before, but I'm gonna film in there. Here, videotape my shirt. I want y'all to see my shirt. My sister got me this last year, I think. Not today, Satan. Not today. <laughs> Thank you. All right, M and S. Here we go. Look how cute. Oh yeah. I don't have no room for nothing else. Okay, so this is <laughs> Alright, this is the um shelves. Let's see. Let me show Leon what they have. They still have these, but you'd have to double stack those. They're three foot. Um they sold a lot. That one sold. Hmm. Hey guys, they are sold out of a lot of their shelves, um, the ones that I saw last time. So, and then uh, some of them in there had paper on them saying that they were sold. So their shipments are coming in um, rather slow, he said. So we're gonna go check out either Lowe's or Walmart. This is the kitchen pantry, not our stocked pantry in the closet in the room. So it's only gonna be holding a minimum of amount of stuff. There is a little bit more moisture in the kitchen, so that's why I really didn't want to get the Walmart cabinets. But if that's what we have to get to go ahead and get this kitchen pantry organized, then that's what we're going to do. But we may go to Lowe's. I'm not sure. We're kind of talking about it. So that's where we're at. Okay, we decided to just come to Walmart to get the shelves. So that's where we're at, Walmart. We're going to go in the garden section. Oh, the plants are a dollar cheaper here than at than at Lowe's. I didn't even think about it. Huh, love? Three ninety eight for their peppers. Three ninety eight for their tomatoes. Yeah, at, at Walmart. So yeah. Look at this mixture. You get English thyme, sage, rosemary, and oregano. It's like a mixture. Oh, that is so neat. I was gonna get me some more cilantro since mine, I had to cut mine all back, but the cilantro is not looking good at all. But this, this is beautiful. So for $3.48, you get a variety of these. So that's rosemary, oh wow, okay. All right, so let me go inside. Leon wanted, he saw the green bell peppers where, oh, it's a sweet green bell pepper. Four, look. 448 for six of them? Well, you, there's a lot in there. There's only one left, so that's one, two, there's quite a many. This one probably, there's a lot in there. All right, well, um, the green bell pepper. We got some, uh, one green bell pepper at home, I believe. Moving along, we're going inside, I believe. Um, all we got was the green bell pepper container to plant the, the, um, the green bell pepper in. I have a black container. Look at 
We do need to actually get some carrots, um, but they don't have any here. I don't know why. Is it not the season for carrots, Bo? Let's take Leon down this aisle to show him the chlorine tablets. So, um, this is the 3-inch HTH. They're $52. The great value, three inch. I don't. Well, this is five pounds right here for thirty eight ninety four. How many pounds is that's that one? Five pounds. Oh, that's five pounds. So okay, so that's more. No, that's five pounds. That's yeah, five pounds. that's the cheapest probably that you're gonna get. Okay, so we're gonna grab some chlorine tablets, and no. let me tell y'all. You okay. did already. I know. So. No, it wasn't a person. It was Glenn Beck said that. Oh, Glenn Beck. Yeah. It was Glenn Beck that told yeah, him that the, the chlorine um, manufacturing plant in Louisiana got destroyed. In one of the hurricanes last year. In one of the hurricanes last year, and they're having problems getting, getting material to rebuild that. Right. So. Um, and that's 40% of the U.S. is chlor uh, Yeah, or they bleach. provide 40% of, of the uh, bleach. bleach to the United, the United States. States. But anyway, the chlorine tablets are good to get. They have a shelf life of basically forever versus your uh, liquid chlorine. Um, some say that it loses its potency after uh, so many years. Yeah. So that's why we got those. So Leon's looking for the dog some treats. and So let me check the dog food out here and see the shelves, love. All right, so here's the uh, dog food at Walmart. And they're not, and this is the cat food, and that's cat litter, so this is the cat food. I think there's another, oh wait, no, this is the cat food. Sorry, you guys. It's hard to look at the shelves and, and also film through the, through the lens of the camera. I can't hardly really read anything, and I'm like, oh, okay, here's the dog food. So, uh, yeah, look at this. It's just. I've never seen it this low at Walmart. So it kind of goes down there. There's a lady right there. Let me pan over. There's a little bit more over here. And, and then here's your canned dog food. So there's actually a lot more canned dog food than they have bagged dog food. So Leon's looking at bird feed for Maya. We are, we're stocked up on bird feed, but we always try to uh, keep her really stocked just in case it can't be um, gotten anymore. And they look like they have plenty. So we usually get Maya. Uh, we get her this time sometimes, the wild harvest. But Leon knows what she likes, so he, that's why he's looking in the bag. <laughs> Let's see which one got the other sunflower seeds. So yeah, so um, we also get this. So this has, is 1288, and she loves the sunflower seeds. So Leon's gonna get that for uh, 1214. How much is in there? Eight pounds, same as that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we're moving along, you guys. And oh, there's some dog food right there. Okay. So there's a little bit of dog food there. And I think oh, here's some right here on this side. So you guys, you know we're always gonna be honest with you. So if we see. Uh, some shelves that are empty and they have some on the center aisle. We are going to let you know that, okay? All right. So that's the deer corn. You need to put the uh, deer feeder back up. Did you? Oh, you set it up in the back? All right. All right, so we're looking at the shelves, looking for the shelves. They have a lot more stuff than they had. I haven't been here in, in several weeks. Okay, guys, as we were walking out, we, Leon seen this shelf right here, um, which is an eight cubicle shelf. It's thicker. It's heavier. It is $92. It's a little bit more expensive, but it is a better shelf. We're not going to get that color. They do not have white, but they have this natural brown color. So we're going to get two of these um, eight cubicle organizers right there instead of the white shelves.
Okay, y'all, while Leon waits on the people to load up those shelves because it's super heavy, they have to put it on a special cart, I'm going to go and um, check the grocery side and see what's going on with the shelves. All right, so I'm passing electronics and then the children's clothes right here. Um, oh, there's some paper towels, plenty of paper towels. And the juices and things. Let's see. All right, there's the juices. Check out the water real quick. All right, so here's the water. So I'm just going to do a quick walk through. All right, let me show you the top. All right. So this is the water. Check out the milk and the eggs. Okay, so here's the milk. It looks like there's plenty, plenty of milk. Um, I'm gonna get some some milk for Leon and I. Hold on. Half gallon of milk is two forty nine for the great value. Okay, I got Leon some chocolate milk. <laughs> He likes it. So here's some cakes, and then here are the here's the eggs. Um, little gap right there. Okay. So you get um, here's I don't understand. This is a twelve a dozen of large eggs for two eighty seven, but then you have. 18 large white eggs for 287 so maybe that's the price i'm not sure there's a price right here 18 large eggs for 424 so that's 18. oh so that's the 18 too okay I always get me some butter i don't need any but i like to freeze it so i'm gonna go ahead and get some Okay, so this is the large boxes of cakes, so um, there's just a few little gaps right there. It's good. There's some right here. Get me some more Diet Cokes, and they're $9.76, so they're definitely not on sale. This is for the 24 packs. Here's 60 eggs. They're large white eggs for $13.93, so you can get a box of those. All right, y'all. I'm getting um, some cottage cheese. I love cottage cheese. Leon does not like it. So this is 24 ounces of cottage cheese. I didn't see a price, of course. <laughs> Alright, so there's no price on the cheese either. I mean, how are you supposed to know how much the stuff is? There's no price. Leon likes this mild cheese. And, or did you get this one? He got the, he got the big one for $3.68. The mild cheddar. So here's the cheese. There's plenty of cheese. There's plenty of ham. There's plenty of hot dogs, you guys. The sausage. Um, let's look at some prices on the bacon. So the bacon, $6.84. They, I think that's a little cheaper than last time. Uh, okay. Yeah, $7.98. That's not cheap. Oh, here's the great value for three fifty eight for twelve ounces. Okay. Hmm. So here is the chicken. Um if I see anything alarming I'll let y'all know. They already have our shelves up front. So um here's the pork chops and uh yeah, a little bear on the pork chops. Um, pork chops, five sixty-eight a pound. Okay, you have a few. Okay, so this is the center all. Leon already has these. Is that the only bag they had? So there's some stuff over there. But yeah, your beef. Um. So yeah, it's a little empty here on the beef. Uh, rock roast, $15.85, a pound. Chuck roast is $27.48, which is $6.67 a pound. T-bone, the ribeyes is $12.47 a pound. 
here's your ground meats. Okay, so this is the french fries. You know, there is a potato shortage. So here is the proof there is a potato shortage because um, there's hardly any fries. They have the shoestring fries. Wow. This is crazy, you guys. I've never been to Walmart where the fries are that low. So let me grab me some uh, crinkled fries for $1.76. You get two pounds. Wow. Wow, baby. Wow. <laughs> that is crazy. I wonder if they have potatoes over there in the garden section. I mean, in the vegetable section. So, um, if I see anything else alarming, I will let y'all know. Here is some long grain rice for five pounds. It's two fifty-eight, and That's not bad at all, you guys. I'll have rice to package tomorrow. I have to package it, so I'm not going to grab any more rice. Let's see how much they are. The green beans are 54 cents for the great value. You get an empty shelf here. It looks like people are maybe stocking up, I guess. Your sweet peas are 54 cents. Remember they were a dollar at the Dollar General. So that's not bad. Yeah, this is gonna be for our pan shop. Yeah, we were kind of lacking in a few things in our kitchen pantry, not our stock pantry. We're lacking in red beans in the can and our stock pan and our kitchen pantry. So Leon's gonna get a case of that's cream style corn love. Okay. So there's there's only cream style corn. Leon didn't know that. He is not crazy about it. that's the only corn they have in the great value. Wow. Okay, unless they have some on the end cap. So let me go see if they have any on the end cap. There's no corn on the end cap. There is no great value corn except for cream corn. This scares me because um, there is other brands. I mean, you know, here's no salt added. You have your Del Monte corn for a dollar thirty-two a can. I'm not paying a dollar thirty-two a can for corn. The great value corn is gone except for the cream corn. They have plenty of green beans and they have sweet peas. They still have that, and Leon's going to get, he got a case of uh, sweet peas and a case of green beans. All right, here is your canned beans. The canned beans are 72 cents um, for the beans. This is crazy. This is crazy. Yeah. So, um, we're going to get some dark kidney beans and some light, if they have the light. So, let me look. All right, there's a case of the dark kidney beans. You guys, they do have the light kidney beans. So we got a case of the light and a case of the dark. Uh, now I'm going to get my, here, babe. Here is the pasta. We're about to leave. Leon's hungry. He has not eaten today. <clears throat> so, um, I haven't either. So, we're about to leave, you guys. Excited about my soup in the cup. I'm glad they had it, and I'm glad the prices were not too high. The is right there. They're bringing them to the truck. <laughs> so, I got uh, chicken tenders for Leon and I to eat since I didn't get a chance to cook our steaks that I was going to cook, our deer steaks. I'm going to cook those tomorrow. Okay. Here's my shoes. 
Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go. I'm going to put the um, kitchen pantry remodel on a, on a separate video. It'll be on the next video. We hope you guys have a wonderful uh, evening, a wonderful night. We love you. Am God bless. <laughs> he's getting tired and he's hungry. And he's wore out as well. And we're both tired. But we love y'all. And until next time, we will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.